at Schwani Pretoria. And a real open game as well, you'd have to say this as, as well. Paraguay against Japan. Two sides who've never been in the last eight of the World Cup finals before. And it goes without saying, one of them is going to break their duck here today. Here's a chance too. Oh, terrific effort from Matsui. Ruttles the crossbar. So a game that was slumbering has just come to life and Daisuke Matsui with a wonderful effort. Morel with a throw, gets it back again. First time, spins it in. And the header wasn't bad. Christian Riveros meeting that, getting away from the defenders. Japan desperate to try and get it clear. And the referee will say that now is that. And now we've got the drama of 30 minutes of extra time. This is Honda on the left foot. Well, the goalkeeper taking no chances there. And it might have taken a touch in the middle as well. Kengo Nakamura coming darting in and maybe just um, unsighting or unsettling the goalkeeper a little. For the first time in these World Cup finals, we are in to a penalty shootout to decide whether it's Japan or Paraguay to go through to the final eight. Kumano with penalty number three for Japan to try and tie things up again. Always oh, hit the crossbar and it's the first miss and Kumano is going to be heartbroken. And Nelson Valdez with a penalty that edges them closer and closer. Four, two, one chance now for Japan. Koizuki Honda, the man with the golden eyebrows, hoping he's still got that golden touch. Japan waits and watches, and Honda, as cool as you like, just rolling it in. If Cardozo scores, Paraguay are through and he will know the weight of expectation that rests on his shoulders. The Japanese on their knees. Oscar Cardozo, with a famous left foot of his, rolls it in and rolls Paraguay home. They're into the last eight for the first time in their history. Just one penalty missed, but that was all it took. Paraguay are through 5-3 on penalties.